Welcome to everyday cooking. Today let us see how to do Andhra style mixed chutney. For the recipe I am going to use adamant creeper. If you don't have this you can use bottle gourd, rich gourd, carrot or radish. If you are using pirandai you have to clean like this. You can use the leaves too. Collect the leaves separately and clean them. The leaves are ready. You have to clean the rest of the creeper separately. So here the stem and the leaves of the adamant creeper are ready. We will now start preparing the chutney. Pour some oil in a pan. To this add a quarter cup of ground nut or peanuts. Fry them well for few minutes. Once the ground nuts are fried well, you can add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds. Once the mustards are done, you can add one teaspoon of black gram. Next is a teaspoon of coriander seeds. Once everything got fried, we'll add a teaspoon of cumin seeds. Cumin seeds will get fried quickly, so you have to add it at the last. Once everything is done, you can take them out. Set this aside. Next, we are going to fry few garlic cloves. You can add around four to five. Fry them for few minutes and take them out. Next is green chilli. You can add around four to five according to your taste. Fry them for few minutes and then add the tomatoes. You can add two big tomatoes. Sauté this until the tomatoes turn soft. Add a little salt. This will help the tomatoes to get cooked quickly. Also add a small piece of tamarind and give everything a nice sauté. Once then you can take them out. Next we are going to add a teaspoon of sesame seeds and fry them. Take them out and add it into the groundnut mixture. Next we are going to sauté the vegetables. Add some oil and then add the vegetables. Here I am going to use adamant creeper, so let me saute that. Leaves will get cooked quickly, so let us add them later. Saute this until they turn slightly brown, and then add the leaves. Again, saute them; they have to shrink and turn slightly brown. Now add the first set that is the groundnut mixture along with the sautéed tamarind and some salt. Grind this without water and then add the sautéed creeper. Grind this and then add the green chilies and the tomatoes. Test for salt if you want you can add some. Grind everything. So here our chutney is ready. Next is tempering. Pour some oil in a pan. To this, add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds, half a teaspoon of black gram, and half a teaspoon of cumin seeds. Let the mustard pop. Once the mustard starts popping, you can add few crushed garlic cloves and one or two dry chilli. To this, add a quarter teaspoon of asafoetida and few curry leaves. Once you have sorted everything well, add the chutney and give a nice mix. You don't need to sorte this. You can give a mix and switch off the stove. Finally, add few chopped onions and few chopped coriander leaves. Give this a nice mix. Your chutney is ready. You can transfer this into a serving bowl. 
this will taste so so good you can have this with rice roti idli dosa and chapati hope you like the recipe we'll join you in another interesting recipe do like share and comment our videos and don't forget to subscribe our channel